So rhino horn medicine is being sold as a cure for everything from cancer to a hangover. Time is most definitely running out for the rhino, with the demand for their horn showing no sign of decreasing. At least two rhinos are killed in South Africa every day because their horns sell on the black market for more than 60,000 US dollars per kilogram, more than the price of gold. Despite many advertising campaigns that have run in South Africa, we're losing the battle against rhino poaching. We needed to target the people in the East buying and using rhino horn with a campaign designed to invade borders. So we turned postage stamps into our new medium. The usual breathtaking imagery was replaced with the carnage that poachers leave behind. A message in Chinese, Thai or Vietnamese reading, say no to rhino horn, was included on each stamp. Letters with our stamp stuck in them would then be sent directly to the perpetrators and also speak directly to them. We then used our stamps to create posters that were distributed countrywide at post offices and game lodges. Stamp booklets and flyers were created, making sure that each and every letter sent became a direct mailer from us to them. Overnight, thousands of stamps arrived in China, Vietnam and Thailand. They achieved what no petition or awareness campaign could. They infiltrated borders and ended up in the hands of those responsible for creating the demand for rhino horn. Soon national press, television and radio caught on, giving our campaign significant momentum. Rhino poaching campaign, it's very powerful. You can add one of these stamps to your letter. So far, we've earned millions in unpaid media. Stop Rhino Poaching has experienced a website traffic increase of over 300%. A majority of this coming from the countries that we targeted with our stamps. The true result, saving rhinos will take more time. But if it takes a million more stamps to end the slaughter, we'll keep sending them.